can't believe I actually have to make this video. So, um, I'm going to be talking about why I'm banned in Shift Chat. I'm going to be talking about, um, why I'm not going to be really running BFBB anymore. I'm going to be talking about why I'm... <clears throat> Why I'm I'm still cool with literally everyone except Shift. I'm pretty sure. So I'm I'm just gonna be talking about that. So um, to get why we got into the argument we got into, you have to go back. I'm gonna turn my monitors off so I look at the camera so it's more helpful. We have to go back to about I'd say September when um a guy by the name of Wurt Weagle came into the BFB community. Um, now Wurt Weagle was a very special fellow, and he he wasn't he wasn't I don't remember exactly what he did at first but the first memory I have of him is him asking really really stupid shit like oh is BF is Hans disable possible in TSSM and we told him no and then like two days later he'd be like I have a theory for Hans disable we're like we looked in the engine it's not possible he's like just try this so he was adamant about uh, disproving us which I guess would have been fine if he didn't also, um, like, he would, first, at first he was saying PFPB is a bad speed game, um, solely for the fact that it's full of tricks and challenging segments, uh, because it's hard, that's why it's bad, and saying that, uh, TSSM is better, which we usually don't like favoritism, um, so we kind of told him, hey, knock it off, both speed games are good in their respective ways, um, and he didn't, uh, and then the side switched. And, um, he hated movie because of rings, um, which, if you guys don't know movie, it's a section where you slide through rings or drive through rings. It's pretty annoying, but it only lasts, like, three minutes tops. So, he, he went on that kick, uh, learned BFPB, did really stupid shit, like, he had just, after we had told him multiple times, hey, uh, you don't need to do this, or we tried to help him with shit, and he just wouldn't listen, um, that would have all been fine on its own. But then there are just some other breaking points. Like, he he associated with a member of the community that we proved to be a splicer. Uh, for those of you who don't know what splicing is, it's where you take multiple parts of a speedrun and stitch it together in editing. Uh, so it's effectively cheating. It, it, it is cheating. That's exactly what it is. But, um... It's, it, it, it got him banned from speedrun.com. Of course, he deleted all the evidence, so the most evidence we have now is a choppy video where he... We had, like, 100% proof, but the video we have now is a little hit and miss. Some people think it's spliced, some people don't, because his manliness counter stays the same, but there's a really big video cut. Um, but it could have just been a capture card glitch, because it happens to uh, Chris all the time. But uh, um, He associated with this member of the community. Uh, he associated with... Uh, I'm chill with this dude now. He associated with Cosmeme back when Cosmeme was super controversial because he made the whole long ass uh, Reddit thread, or not Reddit thread, uh, super speedrun.com forum, um, saying that we need shift on Supermana because he's super biased on the speed games, uh, which is good and which is bad. Um, uh, and then he tried to blackmail me, but I, I've made up with him since then and we're, we're chill. Uh, him blackmailing me wasn't like leaking my address or anything. It was posting that I'm not a reputable member of the community. And when I told him that what he was doing was stupid and that no one actually likes, uh, no one actually would agree with this because uh, you're not reputable. So it was a little bias on both of our parts, but we we made up with that. Um, but Wirt didn't stop. He continued to do stupid shit. Like he would message if you guys don't know who Cole Ud is. He was the very first runner of BFBB. Um, well, not the very first, but one of the first piloted all the tricks, ran the game before Cruise Boost was found. Um, he has stated that he doesn't want to come back to BFBB for, like, at least another, like, two or three years. He's already been gone for two years. He would message Cole about running, um, like, one-second long games, like Inspector Ooh and shit like that. And, um, this is, this is where shit goes downhill. So this is, like, this, like, this, this year, uh, since February... Um, in February, I started to stick up for myself a little bit more. I tried to, to stop, I tried to stop taking uh, a bunch of shit from a different, a bunch of different people. Uh, one of the ones notably being, uh, Hasfar. I called him out on his bullshit a lot, uh, because it was really fucking annoying for him to just, to be fair, I did kind of instigate it sometimes, but he instigated it sometimes as well. And when he instigated it, I would call him out 
and then you know, the Silux would just come in and break us up. It wasn't it wasn't that big of a deal. And I had a uh, DM conversation with him about this uh, the day I got banned. Um, it was on it was yesterday. It was a uh, the third, the fourth of March, twenty eighteen. I had a conversation with it and just asked him to fuck off. And he was like, all right, fine. I won't instigate anymore. My bad, dude. I'm sorry. Um, and we, we kind of made up. We were fine. Um, but let's get, let's get back to word weekle. Cause that's like really the whole root of this situation. So in February, I stopped taking crap from anybody and I started calling people out on their retarded shit. Wirt proceeded to go, he's banned from all the community discords because he's just a retard. He, uh, attacks the mods, he calls our rules stupid, he, uh, calls, he, the, the most notably, he would call Shift a big meanie, um, and he would say shit like, oh, uh, I'll get to that in a minute, um, he would say shit like, oh, Shift is just, Shift is stupid, I don't like him, so he made a Reddit thread asking for a one minute time save. You put a $50 bounty up on a one-minute time save in the SpongeBob SquarePants movie game. And that, that was like the kick. That was, that was what pushed a couple people over to, we need this dude out. Like, now. We need, we had tried to stop giving him attention. That didn't work. He didn't need it. He just seeked it from other people. Um, he had tried to go run Scooby-Doo, but because of what I'm about to mention, he couldn't. So, um, he... He made the Reddit thread. I called him out on it. Tedious called him out on it. And Cosmeme called him out on it. We thought Cosmeme was gone. We thought he was gone. That's that's how stupid this Reddit thread looked. He said, I'm putting a bounty on Hans Disable for like the fourth time. And I'm putting a bounty on a one minute time save. In a fairly optimized speed game. Not nearly as optimized as like uh, BFBB or uh, like uh, maybe like I could compare. I could compare its level of optimization to like. Oh, what's another what's another game around an hour and thirty minutes? I can compare it to like I don't know how optimized the Resident Evil games are. Maybe it's 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 around an hour and thirty in length, and it's a very linear game, so you can't really sequence break that often. Uh, we do it as much as we can. Um, so we called them out. Reddit post got deleted, and this was the straw. I don't know if this was before or after the Reddit post, but I'm mentioning it. Now. This was the straw that broke the camel's back. Just speedrunners in general. He got a board for, if you don't know what Uunaz Fetch a Fruit is, it's a speed game that SM Loader, 50 runners now, it's, it's fucking weird. Um, but there was a predecessor to the game called Inspector Oo. And Wirt Weekle did a run of it, it's like 3 seconds for a beginner run, and he uploaded a speedrun of comments submitted the game. And they accepted it. And he added 25 moderators, including people such as shift people like uh people like shift people like i'm pretty sure he added cole uh, i'm pretty sure he added he added tedious he added silux he added a bunch of people that didn't want to be mod there's even a screenshot of him saying tedious you have mod you should be responsible and tedious replied you don't know how badly i want to get unmodded uh so yeah they could demod themselves but he just demod them back so there was no point so People kept asking, or he made the mod limit 25, imposed by himself. He then proceeded to make a Reddit, or a speedrun.com post that just said 25 mod limit. And then the text was just the N-word. With the hard ER and everything. Just, boom. There it is. He claims Grape edited it. Grape wouldn't, he had no desire to do that. He can't edit other people's posts. He's like, oh, he used a JavaScript editor. Literally, Impulence. One of the most reputable people in the speedrunning community, I know, just because she doesn't give a fuck and she's like straight up honest with everybody. She saw this and she tweeted. She's like, what the fuck? So, he then proceeded to get banned on speedrun.com. And then Tedious was like, I want his Spongebob runs off. Because having someone on the boards who's banned makes your game look bad. That's what we thought. That's That was our mentality. So he talked to me. He talked to the TSSM. He got his TOS times. He got his Truth or Square times gone. He then proceeded to talk to the 
TSSM mods about this. He told me he was talking to TSSM mods about this. And they decided to remove his runs as well. Fast forward to yesterday. I... I, 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 I made up with Ringo about uh, December of 2017, so I hopped in his stream, and I was going to say good luck. I had uh, Chris the Fast unban me because I was still banned, but uh, that's not important. So Chris unbanned me, and Ringo was like, yo, thanks for the good luck, dude. And then Shift starts shit-talking uh, Dan Plays, who had not been in the community for forever. Um, he, he left the community because of just people shitting on him, and he's tried to pick up BFB again, and he can't, and Shift made fun of that, because he tweeted about it, he saw the tweet, and he was shit-talking, uh, Tedious Throne, and since I'm, I, I like to think I'm close, uh, friends with Tedious, I kind of got a little pissed, I was like, hey, uh, I mean, he was like, Wurt Weagle's times did not deserve to be removed, I'm like, I kind of think they do, I mean, he harassed the mods, he posted the n-word on speedrun.com, he did things the mods asked him not to do, we gave him multiple warnings. So then we got into, not only a screaming match, more like me typing and him being the bigger power because he was on the stream. Uh, this is in front of like 25 people by the way. Um, and what really was, it was really weird because as I was doing this, he was calling the group of, the, 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 he was like, oh, how can you say the TSSM community is super welcoming if you kick out new runners? I'm like, Wirt's not a new runner. He's been in the community for th three months. He's done stupid shit the entire time. He's like, well, you did stupid shit the entire time. I did stupid shit for like three months, and I never posted the N-word on forums. I never made Reddit threads asking for strats and giving out bounties or anything like that. No, I was just stupid, and I raged. Okay, getting angry, doing shit the mods repeatedly tell you not to do, resulting in the view of your speed game. Like, you can't tell someone to not get pissed, okay? That does, it's not how it works. If you have anger management issues, you're gonna get pissed. So, and then making your speed game look like people who are racist run it by posting the N-word on the boards. So, removed it, and it wasn't like he had like any percent times that were super competitive. He had an, an extended cheat percent time and a frogfish time. So we were like, go ahead, remove him, no matter what, who cares. Um, he then proceeded to call me a retard, which, okay, not really going to affect me. We got into a really long argument because he was shit-talking TSSM, and then after playing that game a little more, I was like, hey, it's actually a fun speed game. And I, I was getting a little upset, and he's like, you know what, I should have done this a long time ago. So I'm like... Is he banning me in his chat? So I go and I open his chat, and I type in I type in an email, and it says you have been permanently banned from talking in shift. And I'm in a call with Keys, and Keys can tell you I just started laughing, really hard. I just started laughing because it it doesn't really affect me that I'm banned in his chat because I was really only I was really only subbed and following for the sake of BOPB and not really for him because if if you watch shift stream right watch his stream and then go and watch the vod of ringo stream yesterday and tell me look me in the eyes and tell me he would say that on his stream and he would call me out like that on his stream because he wouldn't he wouldn't he wouldn't do it he wouldn't he wouldn't shit talk oh oh then i i've got more to go into Later, later in Ringo's stream, he was shit-talking Tedious for, uh, because he was like, if you hate movie, he takes it as a personal attack. Like, no. I, I make, I hate movie jokes all the time. I'm like, dude, this game fucking sucks. He's like, yeah, whatever. You just suck. I'm like, okay, cool, whatever, fine. He goes, I hate battle. I'm like, you're, you're bad at battle. So it's like, it's, it, and it's, and it's like, there are people who genuinely dislike movie, but Tedious's thing is that Shift is disliking him without actually knowing who he is as a person. He's never sat down and had a conversation with him. So that's what makes Tedious mad. But um, I keep I keep getting off track. But yeah, Shift banned me. He then proceeded to shit talk Purple because he was running movie instead of battle. He was he kept making like, I'm pretty sure he was making whales jokes and uh, shit like that. And like, oh, I gotta run movie, boys. Uh, I gotta get a 132. And uh, this is what was really weird. 
Red Moss, or Shift tweeted out uh, something about movie, and Red Moss, or Red Moss replied, bro, if Mannix takes my third place, or my fourth place, I'm going to die, and TJ's was like, well, the Red Moss, you know, your boards have been super active, like, yeah, he know, and Red Moss replied, yeah, that's super cool, and Shift thought he was being ironic, and I don't think he was being ironic. Shift is always going on about how, like, Red Moss never really tried for any of his PVs, so that's just the kind of dude Red Moss is. He just puts in a little bit of time, grinds the fuck out of it, and he gets it. That's how he, that's how he was with, um, the only thing I can think the dude's done super long-term, like, constantly for over years, us, uh, in Guitar Hero, uh, but those things require constant practice. BFBB, you can grind it out for a month and get a PB and you're good. So, it's not really, it's, it's, I, I, I feel like the reason I was banned was for having an opinion that diversed from his. And I've, I've had conversations with other people that disagreed with the view that Wartweagle's run should be removed. But I, I'm close friends with a couple of them. Um, I talked to Colin about it, and Colin was like, yeah, I'm not going to agree with you, but I'm not going to ban you in my chat or anything like that. I talked to Jessway about it, and Jessway was like, no, I don't think the runs should have been removed, but I'm not going to yell at you and ban you or anything for it because that's stupid. And it, 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 from, from what I've been told, I'm not going to drop names, from what I've been told, it wasn't just last night, it was... They said it's pretty much everything since February 2017, which is literally, like, when I started sticking up for my... I think he meant 2018, uh, because in February 2017, I wasn't in the community, so there was no way I could have done anything. So, that's when I started sticking up myself for Hasfar. That's when I... I'm not shitting on Hasfar, by the way. Um, that's why, because he was actually mature and we worked out our situation... Um, I'm not shitting on anybody except, uh, Schiff, because I think he's a, I've always, for a couple months now, uh, you realize I haven't been in his chat, uh, I didn't really like the way he tackled streaming, because there was a night, couple nights before this, um, where he just, him and his chat were just rolling over a clip for, like, from, like, ten months ago. Like, they were bringing it back, and it was just so fucking retarded. He was like, ha, oh, look at this clip, he's raging and Mermelair, and it was in Glad Jonas, guys, even though it was ten fucking months ago. Like, are you so unoriginal that you had to make up jokes from, like, Dan the Man era? Come the fuck on, man. Um. Yep. I, 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 I don't want to be the next fucking rebag or pro lease peanut, and that's why I'm making this video, to try to make my clear that, um, I'm, I'm just gonna leave it the fuck alone, I'm just gonna speedrun TSSM, and I might pick battle back up, uh, we'll see, that's my cat, I might pick battle back up, um, we'll see, I probably will, um, Probably gonna be learning a couple new speed games, but I don't I don't know if I'll ever take BFPB as serious as I did ever again because of this fucking bullshit. Um, and uh, I I can kind of say uh, literally all the same shit uh, I said about uh, Shift just being a shit talker about Liquid's chat, not Liquid himself, but Liquid's chat. They'll just fucking pound a meme into the ground like they are people who come into my stream from his chat, and just, like, why, dude, really, you're gonna fucking resort to coming into my goddamn stream because of a meme in someone else's chat, like, why, what's the point, um, yep, I'm, uh, I'm kind of done, so, I'm, I'm gonna be playing Guitar Hero a lot, I, I, I just thought I'd throw that out there, I'm not gonna make a new, I was thinking about making a new account on everything, I'm not gonna do that, I'm just gonna stick with this one, um, but, uh, Shift was joking and saying, oh, we don't like you, so we should remove your BFB runs. And I was, like, half tempted to remove them myself, but I didn't want to do that. But, um, yeah. Now you, now you know the true, the true reason I, I, I really don't, I'm not in the community anymore. I had, I had been on and off leaving the Discord for a couple days, actually, before this happened. Because, um... People were just assholes, and 
don't care about anyone's mental health. I even I even talked to someone, and even one of the admins said we took it too far, and I said no, you took it too far the first or second time. This is like the fourth or fifth, and I left the call, and I just fucking I made everyone feel like a piece of shit, and I'm really I don't I kind of don't regret it because there are a couple of people who just kind of said fuck you without learning who I was. Um, I'm not gonna drop names, but you know who I'm fucking referring to if you if that's who you are. Uh, because there are people who can't, uh, form opinions by themselves. They have to just piggyback on everyone else's opinion. So, because even with Wirt, I talked to him myself. Even with Baz, I had talked to Baz myself in the Nicktoons community. And I had seen the fact that he had spliced. Because that's, that's a whole different ballgame. Splicing is not equal to being a retard on the boards. So, um, I'm not gonna go black. Um, and if I do... Uh, it's probably, if it's not black for, like, less than three days, then I'm gone. I'm fucking done. Um, but, yeah, I'm probably gonna be talking to Key. I've been talking to Chris a lot. So, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed me ranting about how, uh, I got banned for having an opinion. So, oh, and it's, it's, it, it's not just Shift's Discord. I'm banned in the BFBB one, too. So I can never learn about a new strat. So, that's also very fun.